Okay, I looked at Steam. This game is on there called Combat Master. Uh, Call of Duty, basically, kind of. But I believe it's on mobile as well. Uh, only thing I've done is gone through and customized some weapons. And that's about it. It's actually a lot like Call of Duty. Yeah, 101 things and uh, I mean some of the emblems are very much Call of Duty, which is interesting. Uh, it has a store very much like Call of Duty. Like everything just looks Call of Duty, so it looks like they just stripped it. A battle pass that goes for 100 tiers. All that jazz. So I haven't played a single game yet. It's the first time playing. I haven't even bothered changing my name. Let's see how it goes. Okay, go back. As I said, it was a mobile game, I believe. So I haven't really changed any settings except the FOV. Uh, I also don't. I think this is Team Deathmatch, but this looks like Deathmatch according to the menu. The leaderboard. Spawns are great, obviously. I just spawned in front of two people. Well, that goes far. I was trying to figure out how to change to my sidearm. Ah, uh, Q? Okay. I was trying to use the mouse wheel, but it hasn't been completed, I guess. Using a mouse, by the way. I keep holding the mouse button as well to aim. Good luck. Keep using the mouse wheel to change gun. <laughs> Let's see how the pistol goes, just for fun. Somehow this suppressor increases range. I don't know how that makes any sense. Too easy. Oh, you get two of them, I just realized. That throw is pretty dark. Uh, oh, damn. Second! Not terrible for the first game, I guess. When you first start this game, or at least when I did, uh, you can get like three, sorry, two, two packs, I think. So, that was something. So I guess this is only Team Deathmatch. I can't see much. This endless chat thing is here as well. Not a fan of that. But that went okay, I gotta say. It's not terrible, it's fast pace. I'm not sure about lobby system because now I gotta play search and destroy, which can be iffy for me. 
I don't really play much Call of Duty. I played, uh, at least this is team oriented. Uh, I played, I don't play Warzone at all. Not my game. Uh, I do play go, go, go. the latest Modern Warfare. Uh, when new updates drop, I play it for a couple days and then that's about it. Stop reloading straight away. Kill Good job. See you on the other side. Ah, uh, so it's three v three. Now, I believe because this is a mobile game, I think six players is the standard thing. I don't know if you can get any more players at all. How did he miss that guy? What was he doing? No. Yeah. Ah, that went well. Too easy. Try and cover right. So first two six by the top left. Where is he? Target eliminated. Now if there's some kind of marking system, not sure. Ah, uh, okay. I think you hold it down. Okay. Target eliminated. So it's not one of those games where you if you're defusing and the bomb's going down, that it just holds it. Tell you what, the pacing is pretty good. good luck. Even though this is like a mobile port, it's it's solid. I gotta say. Target eliminated. Just fix that mouse. Enemy down. All right, we win. Nice and easy. Alright, well, I think that'll do for the first run. Let's see what I can customize. So, yeah, I'm using an impact grenade. I've just unlocked that, but, you know, not my thing. And, yeah, it, you can scroll around. It's obviously built for mobile, so the interface is going to be built in that aspect. Uh, let's see. it for that but yeah you've got tons of attachments to chuck on uh, you can also throw on perks at some point there's a lot of updates coming so there's that uh, you can change their 
colours and stuff. There's also a shooting range, which I've just found. Okay, it tells you all your stats and stuff, interesting. But yeah, uh, that's this <laughs> Combat Master. Uh, pretty interesting game. Okay, am I able to customize? Oh, you can. There you go. There's a new mode here. So yeah, okay, you can take out some stuff. That's alright. And obviously you got some challenges. And you can also do a custom game. Not terrible. Uh, it's actually pretty interesting. Fast paced, all that stuff. So I can see this doing pretty decently on PC if people stick with it. And there's obviously tons of updates to come. There's also kill streaks. Uh, there's only two. So you got your nuke and you got your minigun, and then there's more to come. So there's a lot of elements to this game that's still coming soon. But, I mean, I'm interested to see where it goes.